go. Stop. There we go. Well, Joyce, you looked as though you got that uh, very, very quickly. Uh, what do you think it is? I thought it was Axe go first on this one. Uh, OK. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Okay, well that's our numbers game, and now we come to the final round in the game, round six, and this is back to the letters. It's a little different uh, this time. This is what we call our pre-selected word round. Now, we have actually chosen the eight letters that the contestants are going to have to use, and there they are. Now, what our contestants have to do is use all eight letters to form a word that we have pre-selected, and uh, just a slight clue, we think uh, this word is uh, reasonably pertinent to this programme, and you have uh, 45 seconds, uh, contestants, starting from now. There we go. Well, you obviously finished ma uh, ages before the 45 seconds. Alec, what have you got? Absolutely nothing. That's why I finished so early. <laughs> <laughs> well, Joyce, the choice is yours. Joyce? Selected. Selected. Well, I will just open the envelope here. Selected. That's absolutely right. Just to confirm this. Pre-selected word. Selected. So that's uh, many congratulations to you. And uh, as you can see, that is 12 points to you. So that's uh, a massive total uh, that you have... Uh, you have uh, chosen there. You've, that's, so you are, Joyce, we're very glad to say, you are the winner of this particular round, Joyce Cansfield from Otley. And sadly, we have to say to you, uh, Alec Buchanan, thank you very much indeed for being our, among our first contestants, and uh, goodbye to you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> And now we welcome our next contestant, uh, Christine Jones from Otley. You saw Christine sitting next to Ted, so she knows what the game is all about. Uh, Christine's interests all type of music. You read fiction, you like crosswords and Scrabble. In fact, you were the 1979 national Scrabble champion, yeah. so you should be uh, in a real needle match here against Joyce Cansfield. Now, we now go back to uh, round one, which, of course, is the uh, routine 45-second letters game. So, uh, would you mind starting, please? Uh, uh, All right, we'll, we'll just toss up here, OK? <laughs> there we go. Which hand is it in? That one. That one, OK, you're right. Do you want to start? Yes, please. OK. Off. Would you like to let us hear your choice of letters? Uh, consonant, please. C. Another consonant. T. And another one. M. A vowel. E. Another vowel. E. Another vowel. E. <laughs> consonant. E by gum. L. Last one. And another consonant, please. Right. 45 seconds. The countdown starts now.
there we go. Time's up. Christine, how many letters have you got? Six. Joyce? Five. Off you go, Christine. Uh, helmet. Helmet. Mm. H-E-L-M-E-T. Oh, yes, there's all the audience. They should have got that. <laughs> helmet. Ted, helmet. Well, it's a good word, but it's not as interesting as gazebo. Um, <laughs> I'll look that up while you'll be doing the numbers, and uh, it said gazebo belvedere, which from the telling Belvedere, it means a good gaze. That's why we've got one in the garden. And uh, here is, in the slip, so to speak, Ian Penny, who's uh, going to knock out one of those lovely ladies over there, whoever remains, if he's as good as they are. I wonder if Ian Penny managed to get helmet, did he? Did you get helmet? <laughs> no, not wearing that one today. He got lecture. Oh, no, you didn't, did you? Close. <laughs> <laughs> Trying. Trying. Lecture. No, Letchworth. No, let's shut up. OK. Back to you. Well, uh, thank you very much, Ted. Uh, six points to you, uh, Christine. And now we start again, but this is now 30 seconds. So, uh, Joyce, your choice of words for the 30-second game. Consonant, please. And another one. C. N. And another. L. And another. Q. Goodness me. A vowel, please. I bet you want a vowel now, don't you? No. <laughs> Sorry, we want a vowel. <laughs> There we go. That's a vowel. And then another vowel, please. I. A. And another vowel. O. And the final one. Uh, consonant. Thank you, Joyce. Right, 30 seconds. The countdown starts now. Thirty seconds. Thank you very much indeed. Time is up. How many letters, Joyce? Five. 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 Christine. Five. Okay, Joyce to go. Clown. Clown. C L O W N. Bring in the clowns, Ted. Okay, seems like a cue for you. Yes, I'm afraid so. Uh, the clowns say it's okay. I'm waiting. How did you do? Yes, clown. Yes, we got. We're all clowns. You got here. clown. I just wonder, Christine, what you got? Oh, I've got Colin. I know it's not a name as well, but I think it's, uh, it means something else. Colin. A Colin? Colin. I see. Well, I tell you one thing. We just have to think about that. We'll have a whole week to think about it, because as they used to say, can you come back next week? Thank you very much indeed. Congratulations to you, Joyce, for uh, doing so well so far. That's all from Calendar Countdown. We hope you've enjoyed the first of this series. You hope, we hope very much you've been playing at home and that uh, you've done just as well as our contestants. But I doubt it, because they've done pretty well. But from all of us here in the Calendar Countdown studio, bye-bye. <laughs>